Joyce Mbong, tell viewers of Elila Bamu, thanks for joining me exceptionally today on Sport Flash, coming to you from the inner concave of the Limbe Omni Sports Stadium, where it has been a well-deserved celebration for Team Cameroon that have finished first in their Group M as far as the qualifiers to the 2017 Africa Cup of Nations is concerned. This after beating their Gambian counterpart in this same stadium by two goals to zero. The first goal was scored by team captain Benjamin Mokanju through a penalty kick. At the second segment of the match, it was Carl Toko Ekambi that uh, had the second and winning goal for team Cameroon. Des Lions, ils sont vraiment déployés du mieux qu'ils pouvaient. Ils ont gagné au score 2 à 0. Vraiment bravo les Lions. On espère que mardi prochain ça sera la même chose. Je suis tellement heureux pour le match. Je suis tellement heureux parce que nous gagnons le match. Je suis tellement très heureux. Je ne sais pas ce que je veux dire. Je suis tellement heureux. Je suis tellement heureux. Les joueurs, il y a une certaine progression entre ce groupe. Nous avons fait une bonne performance 4 ans avant contre la Sud-Africa. And I think we have to show something to the public here today. And, uh, that's what the players uh, did today from the beginning in the game. I'm, uh, about uh, Tambe, I think uh, for the first time I have to be satisfied. It's not easy for him to be in that game immediately. And everyone is expecting a lot of him. But uh, I'm satisfied with his uh, performance today. But again, again, I hope he will uh, be better in the... In a few months. Time good enough to talk about the Cameroon Professional League One, uh, which is barely one day to go to the end of uh, the football season in Cameroon. UMS of Loom continue to top the uh, standings as far as that uh, championship is uh, concerned. The weekend was full with lots of action and attraction, following matches counting for the 33 at the Cameroon's Professional Football League, with the following result registered. Astra beat Pante 1-0. Union Douala separated on the one all time with Egli Royal of the Minwa. League leaders, UMS of Loom dismantled Dragon of Yaoundé by two goals to nil. Raseng of Bafusam separated on the zero all time with Apages Academy. Young Sport Academy of Bamenda had an edge over Bambutus FC by one goal to zero. Unispo of Bafang humiliated and sent parking bottom place side Cosmos of Bafia by three goals to one. Leon Blessé that has escaped the relegation specter continue to improve their chances after beating sinking Botafogo by two goals to one. Kanong Yaoundé whitewashed new stars of Douala by two goals to nil. UMS of Loom continue to stand tall and proud at the first position with 69 points. Kotong Sport of Garwa occupies the second spot with 57 points, while Young Sport Academy of Bamenda is at the third spot with 56 points. Meantime, the third bottom teams, as far as the championship is concerned, includes Pante of Banganti, occupies the 16th position with 34 points. Botafogo, that is standing on banana peelings, occupies the 17th spot with 33 points. And Cosmos of Bafia, that is doomed for relegation into the deep and colder sea of Division 2 has just 18 points. Joyce Mbong, tell the viewers of Elilag Bamu, those were the beats and pieces we could put together for you on this edition of Sport Flash, coming to you from the inner boat of the Limbe Omni Sports Stadium. Until we meet again on Tuesday, it is bye from Limbe.